Hi, I'm Mike Beasley, and I'm teaching using Google Analytics for user experience at UPA 2012. Web Analytics offers us the opportunity to inject another data source into our user experience practice. This one, a rich quantitative source that helps us analyze usability test findings, measure the effectiveness of our design work, and communicate better with stakeholders. Even though I'm going to use Google Analytics as the example tool for this class, the topic in this class will apply to all web analytics tools. As a result, I have no doubt that taking this class is the single most important thing you could do at UPA 2012. This class will start with the basics. What is web analytics? How can these tools be put to use for user experience work? And how can we find metrics that will best allow us to measure the effectiveness of our work and present to business stakeholders? We will go on to cover how and why you segment user data, which is a key technique that you will use over and over during analysis. The real power in web analytics data is the ability to compare metrics, either over time or comparing one segment to another, or both. From there, we'll move on to tr visitor, traffic, and content analysis. Essentially, the basic techniques that will get you started learning about your website's users and what they do on your site. We'll tie it all together by talking about how to plug web analytics into other methods, using it to plan usability testing and analyze results, and giving your heuristic evaluations and persona development a boost of quantitative data. As user experience professionals, we are challenged to constantly learn and adapt. Using Google Analytics for user experience will give you a head start on learning how to incorporate these tools into your work. Doing so is essential to maintaining the relevance and leadership of user experience in your organization. If you are not leading the way on web analytics, then someone else will.